Now, one of the things that I constantly talk about is the fact that our worship doesn't just occur at this time, in this place, or, or online. It is every day. It is our walking around lives. In fact, Romans 12 talks about how our spiritual service of worship is the way that we live our lives. So this is kind of like preparation for worship. And one of the reasons that uh, we do our weekly worship opportunities is so you'll know about some very specific ways that you can be involved. And that's why Tiffany is joining me here on stage today because you know what? She has all of the knowledge about what it is that we can do in weekly worship opportunities, you know? So, uh, Tiff, there's something uh, you want to tell us or need to tell us about the app. Yes. Good morning, everyone. So today, while George and I are talking about the weekly worship opportunities, everything that we say can be found online at pgc3.com slash news. If you're watching online, Zoe's dropping links in the live chat right now. So you can just click it and find everything on our online bulletin. If you're here in person, you can open up your web browser and find it there. Or you can open up your PGC3 app. And that second banner, weekly worship opportunities, is where you can find all the links and good stuff to everything that we're talking about today. You know, I, I was just thinking, you know what would be really cool? What's that? Is if we had something where people could actually tell us that they were coming. <laughs> you know, like would. if they could just say, hey, guys, heads up, we're going to be here in the room on Sunday. And you know, we actually do have that. We call it RSVP. It's super easy. There are two ways that you can actually RSVP to let us know that you're coming for service. You can go to pgc3.com slash RSVP. Or you can shoot us a text. The number is 21000. You can just let us know how many people are coming and which service you're coming to. It's not anything formal. It's just a heads up to let us know as we walk towards the holiday season how many people are coming so we can plan accordingly. So it's not a reservation. It's not like, you know, see, I got seats for two or anything like that. It's just kind of like a heads up so that, say, they're bringing food for our feed the need you know, they'll, we, we'll know that, hey, we need some volunteers over there because that, isn't that still going on? Yeah, it's actually wrapping up today. So it's the last day of our Feed the Need Food Drive, and we would love to have a little bit more help to push us right on into Thanksgiving week. We're collecting canned food items, and we're also collecting donations. You can give online, or you can give through Venmo or Cash App. Just make sure any gift that you give says something about Feed the Need, all the money that we raise through this drive is going to buy Thanksgiving dinner food for families in our hometown. You know, this has nothing to do with RSVP and or feeding the need. But you know what I did yesterday? What did you do yesterday? Yesterday, I spent the entire day with Renee shopping for Angel Tree. That is not surprising that you went out all day. Yeah, well, you know, because she is a professional. But uh, we, you know, we had, uh, we love doing that. And uh, we wanted to get the, the best deals that we could for the stuff that we were buying. And so, um, you know, I just, it made me think that uh, we probably ought to let people know about Angel Tree. Yeah, and it's actually happening right now today. So if you're here in person, when you walked in, there was a little area set off to the side full of Christmas gifts from newborn babies all the way up to moms and dads. You have the opportunity to pick through the gifts, find one that you'd like purchase it and bring it back here by December 6th. If you're watching online or if you're not comfortable with going out shopping right now, we do have an online option as well. Zoe's dropping a link in the chat right now for our entire wish list. If you're here in person, there's also a link on our new site. Super easy. All you've got to do is search code shop. Okay. You look through the whole app, the whole list and there is a four or five digit code associated with every individual. So you pick your gift, remember your code, and there's an easy little Google form so we know that you have claimed that person. So they're not picking gifts for themselves. Right, Okay, right, right. they're picking gifts for uh, <laughs> So after you search and you put in your code, then you go shopping. You can go on our Amazon wish list and order items and have them delivered directly here. Or you can go out, purchase your items, and deliver them here yourself. Or if you're so inclined, you can search or shop online and have your items delivered here, 500 Kedron Drive, 
Peachtree City, Georgia, 30269. You know what? You know, I, I keep, since March, it just seems like I hear about online, online. On, everything's online now, yeah. right? Yeah. You know, it's crazy. And so I, I just, in the back of my mind, there's something with our Christmas concert that's, yeah. ha that's happening online that we've. So we are doing things a little differently this year because that. COVID is making us change everything. This year, for the first time ever, we are hosting a virtual Christmas concert. And it sounds a little crazy, but it's going to be incredible. This year on December 6th at 7 p.m., we will be live streaming our entire Christmas concert on Facebook and on YouTube. But two weeks before, so next Sunday and Sunday, December 6th, we'll be handing out watch party boxes. These boxes are going to be filled with cookie dough mix and hot cocoa, some candy canes for you. And we want you to take on the boxes, invite over your family, loved ones, and host a watch party in your home. Throughout the live stream, we'll be doing giveaways like we have a She's Craft Co. gift card. Oh, yeah. We have a grand prize, which is lots of good books. So you can, you can win stuff while you watch. Yes, while you watch. But only while you watch. Yep. Yeah, so you got to watch. And, and then you, we want you to take a picture while you're watching, too. You take a picture. And then you'll be Selfie. Entered, yes, yeah. selfie with a screen. Yeah. Um, but you will be entered to win our grand prize. Prize. So it's an incredible opportunity to share a little bit of joy and a little bit of light during our Christmas season. All right. Well, great. Well, so there's a lot of different worship opportunities that are coming up, and we want you to be aware of those. If you missed anything, as Tiffany said, you can go on our app and get those and see what's going on. But right now, what I'd like for you to do is stand up with us. Tiffany's going to tell us about some giving opportunities, and then the praise team is going to lead us in a time of worship. Thanks for being here. I love you guys. I'm looking forward to sharing this very important message with you. Stand with us. Yeah, so real quick before we dive into our worship through song, we do have a few different ways that we can participate in the gift of giving this year, this Sunday. Um, you can give if you're in person by dropping your gifts on the Lord's Supper table. You can mail in your checks to 500 Kedron Drive, or you can give online, either through our app or through Venmo or Cash App. Just make sure you search PTC3Give. We're so excited to see you this morning, to worship this morning, and to be together as a family. So let's get this thing rolling. <laughs> 